You're on. I'm on. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Just having a rest. It's 9.30, Saturday, the 27th of June. Three days to my birthday. Nice big one. 39? Five. five. No, 39. Five, five. Oh, okay. Anyway, I need to... Uh, ugh. <laughs> I need lots of rest and relaxation yep. for many reasons. Main one that we moved, and if our new place was as big as the last one, I would be bidding on this chair in Ottoman or footstool. That's fantastic. But our place is not big enough. Talk about the light, hey? Yeah, that's, Who is that, David? It's Italian. It's an Italian it? one from the, from the early 70s and the original 70s. Very low estimate. Uh, they retail for about three and a half to four thousand dollars. Three hundred dollars start bid on oh, it. Oh, it is fantastic. It is. And in the right space and all the uh, modern spaces, uh, certainly nice and big. This makes quite a uh, statement. It does. And this is quite comfortable. It's German, uh, made by Care Design. I love the colour. It's, it's very, very nice. Beautiful, it isn't it? is very nice. It's uh, very sort of. Uh, I'm walking around you. Are you okay? I'm trying to be artistic. Is that good? <laughs> oh, oh, I wish I had the long legs to go with it. Oh. Anyway, the auction, the auction, Ooh, the auction be better is come on to bed. When? the 6th of July. Do come and view from 12 till 6. Auction starts at 6.30. But don't forget Saturday. We're open for viewing on Saturday. What time? Saturday noon till 4 p.m. No, 11. 11 a.m. Oh. to 4 p.m. That early? Yeah. Oh my God, we have a long viewing. All right, 11 to 4. Yes. Okay, we'll be here. We'll be here. And before you come along, do have a look at our photos and, of course, our catalogue. Hopefully, you won't have seen me talking to you like this now. But anyway, if you have, look at the photos and the catalogue. Now, Dave is going to tell you something about these lovely things that I didn't post for this. I did not. I'm not David Bromley's model. I won't. I won't. I won't show the lower section. I'm, I'm, Why not? I'm, censor, <laughs> I'm censoring it. Oh, okay. You see what's, how... what's, what's that over there too, David? Over there, the Japanese or Chinese? Uh, Japanese They're very ones. nice. They are very nice. Uh, antique ones, both signed. Come from a and very they good are collection. Trip ditches. Yes. Come from a very good collection. What's the collection? It's a collection from Geelong. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he, w he wouldn't allow us to use his name. Oh, and okay. in the collection is included a lot of his satsuma. He's got so Sunday he's wear. Japanese man. He's Oriental. He likes Japanese mainly. But some fantastic and it's satsuma things. predominantly. Satsuma Klasone wear. So show them some of the satsuma. I can see two over there. There's two big ones here. This is not his. This is from an estate. But oh yeah, in. that's lovely. That's from the Joseph Sands. Is it? No. Yes. Is it? Yes. Oh, yes, it is. Too. <laughs> yes, yes. And this is a genuine old one, 19th century. Uh, very low estimate. It is I lovely. Think, it's a I lovely think we've thing. put two to four hundred dollars on it, and it's in immaculate condition. It is. So hopefully, you all come and bid and drive on this. It's a beautiful piece. And have a look at the, all the satsuma in this cabinet here. It's exciting. Of course, we have a lot of jewellery as well, don't we? Yes, we do. This is a, a large part of the Satsuma collection in there, in there, in there. This, this came through from... This Canada is lovely. This is, this is stunning. It came in, a lady from Smithton, Tasmania sent this Well, She put the nice ring in too. Yeah, the, a very nice uh, emerald and diamond ring. That's lovely. This is by James Dixon, uh, sterling silver, I think 1928, 29. That must have been a typical middle class wedding gift. I think it would have been an upper class wedding gift. Oh, okay, sorry. Uh, middle class and upper is, class this change is now. really upmarket. Just the quality of it is absolutely stunning. Uh huh. I love it. I like this too, David, this cinnabar. Oh, that's massive. It's a fantastic piece. It's an old one, it's not a new one. It's a. Uh, very early Republic, maybe late Queen Dynasty. Actually, the chest is very nice. That's it's a chest also, on chest. Yes, that's come from one of our old clients who lives in Hong Kong now, but he's had this He's been storage. there for like nine years, hasn't he? Yes, he's had this in storage for a long time. Hello, mm -hmm. Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> Won't give his surname away. He, he watches our videos as well. Hi, Joe. Yes, we haven't, we haven't seen him for a long time. In this cabinet, we've got some wonderful things too. I love the very, hey, it is uh, fantastic. Uh, very early Art Nouveau 
Baccarat Crystal Vase, look at that, isn't that stunning? You can't buy Baccarat like that Not in the like retail that. now. There's a stunning piece of web cameo, also an antique piece. This is also web up there, the perfume bottle, the overlay one. Some really nice glass. Another piece of web here, a snakeskin one. Some interesting bits Some of jewellery. Some really nice bits of jewellery. And over, I want to show you over in this cabinet where the oriental things are. Which way, David? Turn around, do a circle. I don't like to move the camera the way Not you do. Far. There's a lot of ivory pieces in this cabinet. I actually find that abstract painting interesting. It is by a lady called Rose Meltzer. Never heard of her. You called her Roth Meltzer originally, but oh, you changed okay. the name. <laughs> That's your enunciation. A, a stunning early rare work by John Rogers. This was on the cover of the catalogue of, at Eastgate Gallery. Was that a retrospective? or Retrospective exhibition. I think it was about 12, 15 years ago. Let's have a look. Let's see. And Jeffrey Smart opened this exhibition. It was 12 years ago. Oh, so I'm right. And I remember the children met Jeffrey Smart. Yes, then. he came down so specially to matter. open this exhibition. There it is on the cover. And there's a write-up about the painting in the uh, Herald Sun as well. Rare work. Very low estimate for it too. We'll go over this way. It's always an eclectic auction, oh, isn't it? Yes. This is interesting, this Art uh, Deco cabin. That one? Yeah. yeah. It's okay. It's interesting. So is the chest, yeah, very chest. different. Not my One cup of tea, but it's interesting. Up. Oh, this is really fashionable. This is going to go out in the uh, uh, the op shop the collection. But I said, no, we can sell this. Yeah, it's lovely. It's really nice. I like the German plaques. They're German, aren't they? Oh, yeah, they're also from the... He's German, lovely. Joseph Sands estate. He's lovely. He, uh, yeah, he's, uh, he's more relief than the other, the other two. Yeah, ones. she's not bad, but he's lovely. Now have a look at this. This is also from the... Is this from the estate? This was from this day, or different? Yeah, that's Joseph Sands as yeah. well. This is a, that's a rare very one. rare moonlit blue pansy vase. You don't come across these every day. Unusual piece. And the other one's fairly rare too, isn't yeah, it? The unusual pomegranate shape one there. And there's a very nice piece of uh, Pamela, 1934, in the crimson and green colours. Unusual cylinder shape. You know what else I really like? The ivory in there. Oh, the piano dolls, I oh, think they're stunning. The piano doll as well, German piano they're dolls. They're really good ones. With original wigs as well. Him and hair. Yes. And this is ivory, this is also beautiful. Ivory and bronze. Can Fully we see signed. Her? Oh, I want to hide her. But you're not buying it. Uh, we, I wish we had <laughs> She's room. She's nice. We haven't you know what room. I really like? Just behind you. Behind me? The Italian um, glazed ivory. I knew you liked that. Yeah. As soon as it came in, I thought, oh, this is beautiful. Original pedestal. This came from another estate, didn't it? Yes, another estate. Yes. Well, it, I forget the name. Yeah, we weren't allowed to use their yeah. details. And there's a lovely little miniature ivory uh, frame panel. Very nice painting on it. Can you, I wonder if it picks up the colours okay. Mm, don't know. No? And this is this is a fantastic piece of Mary Gregory. Also it is trade. brilliant. That's also from Joseph Sands. So when I valued However, it, I didn't see the crack in the back. Unfortunately, there's a crack, an old crack in the back of it. But look at the size. Hey, that sounds like you could do a poem with that. A crack in the back. Mm, I better stop there. <laughs> I said a poem, not a dirty ditty. No, but no, $100 star on it, but it's a stunning uh, rare piece. There's more pieces over here from the estate. A big piece of antique uh, ruby glass. It's an old one too. Okay, so now can you remind them about the auction? Oh, the auction! Yeah, yeah. that's why we're here. Yeah. The auction is on Monday the 6th of July. Are you sure? Yes. 12 noon till 6pm is the viewing. 6.30 is the auction. And also the viewing on the 4th of July, Saturday, 11am to 4 have a look at the catalogue, have a look at the, uh, all the photos online, and most of all, come in and view and bid. See and if you. you can't be here, don't forget your absentees. Oh yes, we accept interstate and overseas bids uh, from all our registered bidders, but you must be registered. And if you want a telephone bid, you can do that on items that are estimated $500 and above. Or otherwise absentee bids below that. Yeah. Okay, we'll see you at the auction. See you then. I bet you don't know how to turn it off. Bye.